Hello everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nakia. I'm a first year dental student at Ohio State. And in today's video, I'm just gonna be taking you all along a productive day in my life. It's gonna be a study vlog. I have so much to do, so many lectures to watch, and I've gotta start studying because finals are basically starting next week and then the week after is when we have the big bulk of our finals so lots to do <laughs> um, as always be sure to subscribe if you aren't already and let's get into the video so before we get into the actual studying i have something very exciting to show you all so we had a lunch and learn a little while ago and it was with oral b crest and they sent us free electric toothbrushes like this is why we signed up for dental school you know so we got the genius x toothbrush i already opened it because i was very excited but we got this yesterday and it basically comes with this and then we get three little brush heads for it which is really nice so i'm gonna start using that i haven't used it yet because i wanted to show you all but super exciting and then it also comes with the oral b travel case which is nice i like the color i had the sonicare one while i still have the sonicare one um, i haven't been using it recently but <laughs> i just use the manual toothbrush but i'm excited to try this out and i will be sure to let you all know so that's super exciting also there may be an intermission in this video because something that i ordered is supposed to be delivered today it's super exciting i'm very excited to show you all so if that happens there will be a brief intermission and then we will continue the vlog so all right, I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to make a to-do list of everything that I have to get done today or that I want to get done today, or I hope that I can get done today because like I said, I kind of have a lot that I need to do and I'll take you along, so let's go. So I'm really upset <laughs> because I filmed another clip and it wasn't recording, so. Basically, what you missed, <laughs> I just got a notification that I have a package and I'm so excited, so I'm going to go get that. But I finished writing my to-do list. As you can see, there's a lot of stuff that I need to get done today. So, the goal for today is I need to finish making my Anki cards um, up until the lecture that we are at least at right now. I have to add things for about three more lectures to, to my Anki. So I'm gonna do that. Then I need to finish watching the Histo lecture from last week, last Friday, because I went to drill while she was finishing that. So I need to finish that, watch the one for yesterday, and then maybe if I have time, get to another one, because after that, there's only one other lecture. So I definitely wanna get those done. So all I have to do is just study. And then I'm also gonna start studying for oral anatomy because that's the one that we have right when we get back. It's like Tuesday after Thanksgiving break. So we have that written. I need to finish my Quizlet for that. I also need to start rewatching and reading the chapters. So I'm going to rewatch the lecture for chapter one and two, read the chapters, answer the questions, and then hopefully get to chapter three today as well. Watch that, read the chapter, and then also answer the questions. And I need to update my study guide as I'm going along. So lots to do, but you know I have to go get my package. I'm going to go get that and I will be right back. So quick intermission to show you all. I got a vlog camera. <laughs> so exciting. I know I've said exciting like 20 times in this video already, but... I'm pumped. So I got the Canon M6 Mark II. I was going back and forth between getting this one or getting the Canon G7X, which is what a lot of the vloggers use, but the Canon G7X is really only for vlogging and I wanted something that I could do like all different types of videos for. So I decided to go with this one and I'm so excited to open it. <laughs> okay. Instructions, read those later comes with the Canon little strap for the camera. 
comes with one battery. I'll probably be needing to get another one of those. Most YouTubers that I watch have a couple batteries. Oh, I think this is the lens. Yes, this is the lens. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. So I did get it with the kit lens, which I believe is 15 to 45. I don't know anything about cameras, so hopefully you're not here to watch a camera review because <laughs> that's not what this is. But I got that. So very nice, it has that on it. I won't take that off until I open the camera. Then let's see what this is. This also has a, a viewfinder that you can add, so I'm pretty sure that's what this is. Obviously, you can't see anything right now, but it comes with a little viewfinder. And then, let's see. Oh, to charge the battery. So I will need to do that, and then... It's so cute. So, it's a good size. I think I was imagining it being a little bigger, but I'm really happy with this because I'm primarily using it for vlogging, which is why I got it. But it's also a mirrorless camera, so you can change the lens, and that's the biggest reason why I got it, because with the Canon G7X, it's not mirrorless. It's just whatever lens is on there is what you have and so I wanted to be able to change the lens to adapt for if I'm making different types of videos so it is so cute look at it <laughs> I'm so excited and it has a grip the other thing I was debating against a lot of vloggers also use the Canon M50 and I just really hated the flip out screen so the screen flips this way and I hated that. I wanted one with the flip up screen just because I think it's better for vlogging anyway. So, oh my gosh. <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay. So let me put this on and see what it looks like with the lens on it. <laughs> Guys, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. So, this is what it looks like with the lens on there. You can see my current setup with my phone. So cute. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. Oh. <laughs> I kind of need to put the battery in there. <laughs> this is my first camera, if you can't tell. <laughs> okay. Okay, now we're going to turn it on. Maybe. Is the battery dead? I think the battery is dead. Lovely, unless that's not the... Let me look at the instructions <laughs> before I break it. Okay, so I'm actually gonna go back to studying <laughs> while that's charging, but I'm so excited about this camera. I am so pumped. It also has a place where you can add an external mic to it. So that'll be nice. Like I said, I wanted to be able to have a camera that gave me versatility to do all different types of videos, sit downs, vlogs, all of that. So. I thought this was the best. So I'm gonna start studying while that battery is charging and then I will give you all a camera update once it finishes. So I just got done with one of my presentations, adding that into Anki for human anatomy. And now I'm going to start watching my lectures for oral anatomy. Literally that took so long putting those things into Anki, but I know it's just gonna be super helpful to study that way. So we do it anyway, but real quick, I wanted to talk about how I go about watching lectures, rewatching lectures, how I do my notes. If you want a full, how I take notes video, I can make it. Leave me a comment down below, but I'm telling you, I don't really take 
notes in the sense that I don't do handwritten notes. It just takes way too much time and I'm the type of person who would be like so caught up in how my writing looks and not even retain the information that way. So I don't do that. But in terms of watching the lectures, I will watch the lectures and then I will go through on notability and I will just make notes adding to the presentation slides that the provider that the there's a train there <laughs> i will add to the powerpoints that our professors will give us and i'll just jot down little notes of things that that they said that's not on the slide or underline things star things and that's pretty much all i do in terms of note taking and then i will go to either anki or quizlet put the information there and that's pretty much how I do it. So, and then of course I'll go back through and I'll we'll reread the slides and then also reread my handwritten notes that I did on the slides. So that's pretty much how I do it, but let me show you my notability real quick. Okay, so here's my notability. Of course I have all of my classes on tabs here and then each one has its own subjects to it. And so, for oral anatomy, which are the lectures I'm getting ready to watch, for example, I will just download the slides, of course, and then as I'm going through the lectures, either watching them live or watching them recorded, I go through and I jot down notes of things that weren't said. Like, so for example, on the slide, the only thing that was said on the slide was the stuff that's typed. So I just think it's easier for me to be able to look back at what I've written on the slide as a way of kind of having that information there. And so same thing, I just write down little notes and stuff, but I don't really do handwritten notes. <laughs> just like I said, it takes way too much time and I don't retain information that well, but sometimes I'll also do like a study guide where I'll put the information here. And obviously if you can't tell, I'm kind of a visual learner. So having things color coded and all that makes it so much more easy. And then I also like just add pictures and things that way everything is all in one place because pictures are important in dental school so that's my study guide for the practical that we just had but that's pretty much what i do in terms of note taking so i wanted to just go ahead and close out the video thank you all so much for watching if you haven't yet please be sure to subscribe like this video and leave me a comment letting me know any questions that you all have i'm filming this with my new camera so i guess we'll see how the quality looks <laughs> but anyway thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye